joke this time. Get together.
good crowd. Um, we'll tune in just a second and then retune again when the house lights go down. Just a quick story this afternoon. I spent in the emergency room. Oh, lights, <laughs> I am great. It was a kidney stone. Uh, with, wow, there's some sympathy. <laughs> I get them uh, uh, fairly often, so so that's what I was doing. I was uh, hooked up to an IV. Good freak. Nice and hydrated. Nice and hydrated, yeah, exactly. Exactly. So, yeah, why don't we do a tuning now and then do another one later?
tell him he's been chosen. I want to 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 tell him he's been chosen. If only I could tell the news. Step up and take on some challenges. Sure, challenged me, all right. 
First thing that happened after I got here was getting chased by a giant serpent. Oh, that one right there? Yeah. Oh, <clears throat> yes, uh, that one, right there. Well, would you look at that? It's pretty dead. Um, say, did you kill this beast? Yes. <laughs> yes, I did. See, my line of work can be kind of dangerous, so it's a good thing I'm pretty strong. You never know what you can find out here. So there I was, just minding my own business, when all of a sudden I hear someone hop. Hopagano! Oh, yes. That'll be for me. Papagano! 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 Hello, ladies. How are you on this fine day? I guess you brought my lunch. I've got some fabulous birds here for you. What have we told you about lying? Well, I, uh... You know better, Papageno. Lying and boasting. Shame on you. You'd better have a good think about your behavior. And no lunch for you today. Instead, a lock for your lips. That should teach you a lesson. Now, did you kill that beast? Young man, Tamino, welcome to Winchcraft. We are the ones who rescued you. Dragons and serpents around here are generally not harmful, but... Occasionally, one will go rogue. We subdued the creature. We have a mission for you, from the Queen. We need someone who is brave and compassionate. Someone of high character and courage. <coughs> Though you did run from the serpent, we have some inspiration for you. Here is a portrait for you. It is Pamina, the Queen's daughter. A most brilliant student at Winchcroft. The now two of you must accomplish a mighty mission, to restore the Suncrest which was stolen from the Queen years ago. Now, Pamina is missing, and our queen is most distressed. We think she's been kidnapped, a prisoner. She's counting upon your help, Tamino. Look well on the portrait. See how lovely she is. Perhaps you will find your courage and inspiration there.
feet, young man. The queen has been observing you. She wants to see if you are worthy of rescuing her daughter. Prepare yourself. Here she comes. She's here. She's here.
wood stirring. Come on, I'm not afraid. She doesn't look too well. She's paler than a snowflake. That is butter, though that I see. That is butter, though sir, tend me. Stay back there, take that there. Don't hurt me now, don't hurt me now. Shoo, 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 shoo. I'm Papageno. Say, you're Camina, aren't you? Yeah, you match the portrait. Say, your mother's looking for you. M my mother? You know her? <laughs> sure, I'm her expert avian accessorizer. Uh, but listen to this. This new fellow arrived at Winchcroft today, and right away she said that he needed to be the one to come and rescue you. What? Rescue me? But I was supposed to find the sun crest that was taken from my mother and get it back for her. Well, I was caught. Monostatos is on my trail. Thanks, by the way. <laughs> You're welcome, my lady. But anyway, this new fellow, Tamino's his name, he took one look at your portrait and signed on as quick as anything to help. If you ask me, I'd say he fell in love with you right away. He felt all that from my picture? Yep, he gave that to me so I could help look for you. He said he had it memorized. He wants to rescue me? Tell me no. <laughs> I don't think anyone's ever done that for me before. It's nice. Yeah, pretty great having someone fall in love with you all of a sudden. Well, not that I know. Sorry, it's just catching birds gets a little lonely. I mean, they're great, but what I really want more than anything in the world is a girl and a family. I never had brothers and sisters of my own. And be nice to have some kids so I could play with them and a girl. One that doesn't mind them. Such a dope. I'm sure there's a girl out there for you. You'll find her. Keep faith, my friend. It'll happen. I know it. <laughs> well, we know you got yours, so let's go find them, shall we? <laughs> Master, 
He is a tyrant, not a man. Explain, why make such accusations? A crime against a desperate woman, oppressed by grief and endless woe. A woman filled with rage and spite, no doubt the queen then telling lies. And you believed her every word. Wait till Zarastro comes here, his motive will be clear. His motive I can clearly see, was it not he and no one else who stole Parmina from her mother? Ah, yes, indeed, that much is true. Where is she? Where's Parmina now? My mind is filled with such confusion. I
boisterous laugh has earned your wrath. Can you imagine what he did? And with this fool he was eager to snatch Paulina from your grasp. But from a pipe I could not conceal her. You know me and my evil eye. Pamina's father had hoped that the sun crest would come to her. We have already seen her courage and honest heart. However, we must see about her strength and steadiness of character. Can she bear the difficulties? And what about Tamina? So far, we have seen that he is fiery and impulsive. Yes, he is quick to lead to anger. However, he is also quick to help others. We shall see if he can show some patience and self-control. And what of Papageno? He doesn't have the character of the other two. He lacks courage. He cannot keep quiet. He is also indiscreet, yes. But he has a warm heart. Perhaps he can be, uh, perhaps he can be persuaded to be, perhaps he can be persuaded to be useful for his friend's sake as a form of encouragement. All he wants is a girl. <laughs> yes, that could be managed if he earns her. For now, let us have a blessing as Pamina and Tamina embark upon these trials. <laughs>
going to be tested. Do you agree to undergo these trials so that we may begin to understand your strengths and weaknesses? Yes. No. <laughs> yes. No. I can assure you both that if you are willing to try, you will find the answers your heart most desires. Well, what must we do? You are both placed under a strict vow of silence. No word, no information may leave your confidence. You may briefly confer, but aside from that, total silence. I don't really think I'm cut out for this, Steve. I'm a talker, so I... Pop again! Are you willing to try? For your friends, there may be a reward should you succeed. Yeah, such as? Do your best. You are on your honor from here on. <laughs> Tamina, what do you think you meant by reward? Oh, come on. They said we could confer. That's all I'm doing. I'm conferring. Doesn't this seem a little fishy to you? <laughs> I don't like this. I don't like this at all. Fly, 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 in this dark and dreadful place. Fly, oh fly, what disaster you will face. Tell me no, we have come to warn you. And Papa Gaino, they will scorn you. This is more than I can bear. Papa Gaino must take care. Don't forget how I was broken. If a single word is spoken, you heard them say our doom is near. Just be still and have no fear. Just be still now, just be still. How can we sit still and be still? The queen herself is we near us, her fears near us, her tears near at hand. What's that? The queen is coming here. How dare Zoroastro treat me like this? I work day and night, 
keeping watch and seizing mischief makers. And what happens? Do I get thanks or gratitude? No, I'm treated like I'm the misbehaving student. Zoroastro insults me and pampers those scoundrels. I'll teach them to defy me. I'll show them all. Learned our lesson, have we? Away from her, you treacherous snake! Get out! Mother! You hardly deserve to call me mother. Where is the sun crest? Where is the young man I sent here to help you get it? Well, Tamino, he's with the teachers in Zorostro. So he is lost, disappointing. Then you must get it yourself. But uh, Zoroastro deceived your father and won him over with lies and flattery. So he gave away the powerful crest that should have been mine and yours. You must get it back and bring destruction to Zoroastro. But mother, I... Enough!
planning a little robbery and treachery, are we? No. <laughs> Wait till everyone hears that the honest and clever Polina is a thief and conspirator. I can't wait to see their faces when you're ashamed in front of them all. I would never. Ha! There you are. Time for you to come with me, please. Good evening, Monocitos. Still here. Sir, this young lady. Yes. Thank you, Monocitos. Sir, she and her mother are planning robbery and destruction. Sounds most dramatic. Thank you, Monocitos. Good evening. I must explain. Your mother wishes for you to steal the sun crest, does she not? Well, yes, sir, but but please don't punish her. I mean, I would never, but she was upset, <laughs> and it was supposed to be hers after my father died. The sun crest bears enormous power, Pamina. Your father entrusted it to me. It belongs in the hands of someone steady and virtuous. In fact, he meant for it to come to you, if you prove yourself worthy of it. Well, then I could give it to my mother. No. The sun crest could never be hers. I would be bound to prevent it. It does not belong in the hands of someone who lusts after its power. But do not be afraid for your mother, Camina. A twisted soul such as hers is punishment enough. It's easy for you to be quiet. Some of us just have a lot to say. I don't even have my birds for company now. Oh, hello. Did you see anything come flying in here? Thought I saw a fairy wren. I was looking for it. A bird with blue on its wings has magical powers, you know. What was it after, do you think? It's a mystery. Do you like birds? I'm Papagena. Who are you? Once more to meet you here in 
his command, we're here to greet you, and we return your flute and bells. Take this refreshment we provide you, now eat and drink and have no fear, later when we're once more beside you, then you will find that joy is near. Tommy, no hear. Be strong of will. You, Papa Gano. You, be still. Hush, hush. You be still, hush, hush, you be still. Tamino, did you see her? Papa Gaina. I'm gonna smash this test. <laughs> hey! Food, nice, huh? <coughs> hey, Mr. Strict, they said we could eat. This is the best way to stay quiet. <laughs> I heard your flute the sound brought me right to ya. <laughs> Tamino, what's wrong? Why won't you look at me? Papageno, what's happening here? What's wrong? <laughs> oh no, you too? Is it me? W what did I do? Tamino, we saw each other and we were happy. What's wrong? You just tell me. I thought we were meant to be together. Was I wrong? J just tell me the truth. Nothing?
everything feels quite jumbled today, doesn't it? The air smells like wormwood. Ah, time for a snack. That's usually helpful. Maybe Felina needs a snack. She definitely looks upset. I'd say quite heartbroken. Perhaps she's feeling alone. You've been waiting here a while. Do you like it here? You never told me your name. No. I don't like it here. I'm tired of all this waiting. My name is... No! One, two, three, 
two. Two and a half. No, no, there's no reply. So that's it, it's time to die. No salvation is in sight. Cruel world, I'll say good night. Cruel world, I'll say good night. Oh no, oh, no, hold oh, oh, back. Oh, oh Papa Gay, no, no. And cry, there's happiness in store. My little friends, you are well spoken, but unlike me, your hearts are broken. And when you're my age, you'll know why unhappy lovers want to die. So take your magic bells and play them, and Papa Gaina will obey them. How very foolishly I acted. Silver bells keep ringing, bring my sweetheart here. 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 Silver bells keep ringing. Bring the gift, bring the gift, right here to me. Now, Papa Gay, no turn around.